I wanted a simple black watch with the time display big enough that I could read it without my glasses. And this is exactly the one I was looking for. Now here's what I like about it. Even though it's a minimalist design, it's very attractive. As you can see, it has a black face inside here with a gray circle around it, and then the rest of it is black, including the band. It's thin. It's only 10 millimeters thick, 3.9 inches, according to my inexpensive digital calipers. So that's, that's pretty thin, <clears throat> about like an Apple Watch or something. <clears throat> the uh, it doesn't interfere that way with things like long sleeves when when I wear them. But the diameter is large. It's over 45 millimeters across. Not the, the reading face, but the whole thing. So it does fill the space on my wrist, as you can see. But it doesn't go over. And it's. I just think it's a good combination of large, but not too large. But not too thick. And the... Silicone band is really nice because it keeps it tight on my wrist, but it doesn't feel like it's constricting me. Um, I can get this pretty tight. And then, you know, it's, it's not shaking around, it's, uh, but it doesn't feel like it's cutting off my circulation or anything. It has all the basic features I would need, like an alarm. So it's just a simple, functional, attractive watch that's going to be good for everyday wear. Here's what it looks like with the backlit feature, which doesn't stay on for long. <clears throat> the instructions are simple, and so is changing the settings, as long as you don't lose the instructions. Small two pages, color pictures. I'll be filing that away, so I make sure I have it uh, if and when I need it. Uh, it's waterproof down to a reasonable depth. So that's good. I don't have to worry about getting it wet. Uh, the only thing to consider, I would say, on this watch, and I find this to be the case with other watches I own, I have pretty small wrists, even though I'm 5'10 man with uh, about 175 pound frame. But I want to show how the band on this comes three quarters of the way around my wrist. So I can see that when I'm looking at the watch. It just, it'd be nice if it stopped somewhere under my wrist instead of on the side here. But better to have more than too little. So uh, it's not a deal breaker for me. And yeah, I'm very happy with the watch.